Hello fellow YouTubers, welcome to my channel. Hope you are a subscriber. If you're not a subscriber, please become one. Let's talk about this Gold Quartz Electronics. Starting from the source of power battery. It's a 12S 8P Sony VC-T6 battery with a balanced charger. It's connected directly into the speed controller and in this case it's flip sky 6.6 uh, .6 that i run at 80 amps per motor i am pretty impressed by this controller it handles 80 amps per motor pretty easily uh, i did have to put it on a aluminum heat sink and put some active cooling fans on before the heat sink it would get hot at 80 amp per motor output as I run it hard and reduce power output in order to protect itself. But with the aluminum heat sink and two small fans, it runs cool. It doesn't even get hot after long ride that are really hard. Motors I'm using are Flip Sky 6384, 190 KV motors. Uh, they are rated up to 80 amps and this is what I'm running them at. at. This week I'm going to be upgrading the motor to 80-85 motor just to give it more of a resource. Uh, this is plenty of power but the motors are running pretty hot um, so I'm running them at max capacity. This is what I'm going to upgrade it to. It's gonna be my next project for this go-kart build. In order to run the cooling fans and potentially later have a 12 volt power source somewhere on the go-kart, I've installed this uh, lithium ion battery, it's 12 volt. It's got a USB, char USB charger plug and a 12 volt output. Right now it's only running the fans. So that's the, that's the powertrain. I got some bicycle lights, they also run off of a USB charger. And headlights, also bicycle lights. The rest of the video will be going over the build of this 12, 12S 8P battery. Hope you enjoy.